Hey guys, Alana again here. Thank you for joining us for another episode of our digital road trip with HP, AMD, and Microsoft, empowering the way you work. Today, we're joined by Rick Renswick, who's gonna walk us through the new ProBook X360 435. Hey Rick, thanks so much for joining me today. Hi Alana, hey, I'm very happy to be here. Hey, thanks so much. So the X360 by far is maybe one of my favorite products in the HP commercial suite lineup. Can you tell me a little bit about the X360 and what your favorite parts of it are? Sure. And I, and I would have to agree with you. It is one of my favorite notebooks too. I've been in, I've been in this business for a lot of years and worked on a lot of different notebooks. And when I look at this and I compare it to premium notebooks, this, this definitely I think is helping redefine what a value business notebook is. And, and the first thing that you can notice in the design is the aluminum uh, lid here, the A cover. All aluminum, uh, anodized, it's in the pike silver color, very distinctive. Uh, when you open up the unit itself, which by the way, it has the lift anywhere edge here, and that edge allows you to easily open the device, but the keyboard deck, that is made of forged aluminum. So we've got aluminum on the top, we've got aluminum on the inside, and then on the bottom, it's serviceable, and it's serviceable with the plastic, uh, uh, bottom cover here. And the serviceability is real simple because there are seven self-captured Phillips screws here. And so it's very easy to take the take the back cover off and, and do what you need to do. Uh, but the thing I really like about this and is is the, the versatility and the flexibility of the design. So with an X360 one of the one of the benefits is you have all these different modes. So if I am a clamshell user you know, I can put it in clamshell mode. And I'm a big guy, so I may want to lean it back a little bit further. I have that flexibility. But if I want to share with somebody, I can put it on intent mode. And now in intent mode, I can easily collaborate. Or I could do an, a, yet another mode, which is tablet mode. And if you like to take notes, the HP Pro Pen, great tool uh, to use to take those notes. You're absolutely right. And there's a fourth way that my family likes to use it, which is the lay flat design. They've realized that with that 360 hinge, they can lay it absolutely flat and slide it under the door just when they know I'm too busy to help them. Now, that may be their favorite part of the X360, but it's definitely not mine. I know that that X360 is powered by the new Ryzen Ryzen Pro processors and all of the Windows Pro capabilities. What are you thinking about the new Ryzen Pro processors on the market? You know, it, there was an old car saying years ago that uh, this isn't your, your, your father's Buick. Well, this isn't your father's AMD. What AMD has been able to accomplish with the new Ryzen and Ryzen Pro architecture is just phenomenal. This is a screaming fast processor that is able to handle huge workloads. Uh, the other thing I really like about it, integrated AMD Radeon graphics, which AMD has always been known for their high performance graphics. And with, with this implementation that put the two together, you've got a really, really powerful notebook that should help anyone power through the day get, and keep them productive. And you're absolutely right, Rick. And productivity is incredibly important from our enterprise to small business and education customers across the board. So why don't we start with enterprise? For the enterprise sector in particular, I know we have a heavy focus on HP to make sure that we have the most secure commercial product fleet out there on the market. Tell me about the security features that come with the X360. Yeah, if if you look at HP historically, you know we've been we've been uh, in the forefront of security, hardware hardware based security in our devices for a number of years, and uh, a lot of our premium security features have always been kind of relegated to the elite line. Well, now we've moved that down. We've moved it down into the 400 series, and now the 435 actually has many of the same security features that our elite line has. So. You get a few worth pointing out is HP Sure Start uh, for AMD, and the thing that's really cool about HP Sure Start is not only can it keep you secure, but it can help IT save money because what it is is a self-healing BIOS. So whether your BIOS becomes corrupted, corrupted from malware, or Gremlins just you know shut it down, HP Sure Start will actually recognize that change, that deviation in the code, and it will automatically self-heal the BIOS. It'll replace it with a good copy and you're back up and running. So that's a real powerful um, 
a powerful security feature. So you're telling me, Rick, that if something happens to my BIOS, I don't have to ship it back to corporate and have them re-image it and then ship it back to me. I can just do it right there? That's absolutely correct. And, and again, that's one of the things that IT departments are going to love or do love about SureStart is that, you know, typically if I do have a BIOS problem, my, say I get, get the corrupt BIOS, and I'm sure many of you have had that happen to you as well. Uh, at that point, you're kind of dead in the water because IT has to manually repair it. With SureStart, what it does is it recognizes the problem at the BIOS level before the operating system fires up, and then it goes ahead and it self-heals that BIOS. So by the time you restart the system, everything is good. Man, that's great news. Talk about job security, especially with one of the most critical parts of your PC. It seems like it's perfectly solution for our enterprise business, but also small, medium business. I understand that when we first designed the X360 435 G7, we actually had our small, medium business owners in mind. After all, there's nothing about them that's small, but I want to make sure that it sustains the business continuity that they need to run their business end to end. Can you tell me a little bit about the power and continuity that we can expect from the X360? Yeah, I think, I think uh, for growing businesses and uh, organizations that don't have a lot of resources in terms of IT, they may only have a few people. Uh, if you're working in a school district, you might have less than 10. Uh, but if you have those limited resources, we also provide some additional security features that are designed to reduce time, save you time save you time to do more important things uh, that you need to get done. So we have products like HP SureClick. And HP SureClick is essentially a, a virtual browser. Uh, and what it does is when you open up, uh, when you go to a website using the, using the SureClick browser or you open up an attachment within that, within that site, it's all open in this sandboxed browser, this virtual container, and what that means is by opening it in that environment, it's not physically on your system. So if you do come across something bad, to get rid of it, all you do is X out, you know, close that tab and, and the malware's gone. It never had a chance to get on. So from, you know, when you think about phishing right now, huge. Ransomware running rampant. This is this HP SureClick can really help uh, help you provide another level, another layer of protection at the browser level. I imagine that SureClick is even further increased in terms of security when we use Microsoft's new Microsoft Edge, which in and of itself is already a more secure browser than what we've seen in the past. Now, specifically around business continuity though, because those businesses run end to end from morning to night, I wanna make sure that this PC can hold a charge as well as make sure I have connectivity throughout the day. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Sure, sure. Well, it, and, it, and it really starts with the AMD Ryzen and Ryzen Pro processor and the technology that's built into that because what AMD has been able to do is really uh, eliminate the gap uh, in terms of battery life and battery performance. So you can, you can get a solid full day of, of work on a single charge. But if you are in a position where you do need to charge the battery, uh, all you need to do is plug it in and HP Fast Charge will charge that battery up to 50% in just 30 minutes. So you can get half the power back in less than you know a half hour. So a very, very solid feature to keep that business continuity, to keep you productive throughout the day. That's incredibly important. I understand it also comes with the Wi-Fi 6, so improved connectivity no matter where you are in the house. Now for me, I do have an X360, and I'm actually not the number one user of that PC, it's my kids for school. So they like that lay flat design to slide it under the door to get it to me, but they also really like to use it for their education, whether it's with the HP Pro Pin where they can write on there, powered by Windows Inc., or the really durable Corning Gorilla Glass that comes with the screen. Now, with my kids touching it though, I wanna make sure it's safe, secure in terms of security, but also sanitized because kids. Can you tell me a little bit about that, Rick? Yeah, the sanitization obviously is something big right now, and this product is completely wipeable, you know, with the anodized aluminum cover. But the thing that's really nice is the keyboard itself is completely sanitizable as well. And, and that's really big, like you said, Alana, with, with kids and, and in a school environment, you know, 
grubby little hands everywhere, this is going to be one way to take, uh, take care of that. So that's, that's a very positive feature. Yeah, that sanitizable keyboard, but also the spill resistant keyboard. So anytime a spill does happen, it doesn't just totally wipe my PC. Now it's not just about the keyboard though that I'm excited. It's about the camera as well as the optional world facing second camera. So like you said, we can take those four different functions, whether it's flat, tint, tablet, tablet and clamshell <laughs> tablet or clamshell and using them end to end now the other thing though like i mentioned the easy transition from home to school to play is incredibly important for me yeah and and one of the things though that i really like about the camera setup here is yeah you get your standard 720p camera up here and it does have the uh, hp privacy camera shutter so you can you can easily just slide that shutter and close uh close the lens so that's, that's from a security and, and privacy, uh, that's another nice feature. But in addition to this camera, there is an option for a second camera right here in the keyboard deck. Why is that important? Because now as I'm using it in tablet mode, it works much like my phone and I can take a picture. So th that, that is a really nice adder. And then you mentioned the world facing mics, which the world facing mics just means they're on this cover here on the A cover. And what those mics do is um, they provide a higher level of noise cancellation. So if you're in a room and, and you have a ceiling fan going and you've got, you know, clicking on your keyboard and, and the dog barks, what this is going to help do is minimize those sounds so that they're not disruptive. I love that. And that camera and the keyboard is something I've not actually seen before from our HP fleet. So I'm really excited to see just the versatility that comes with the X360 435. Now on top of being incredibly versatile, I want to make sure though that we're staying true to what matters to me, which is around sustainability and leaving the environment in a better place than I found it. Can you tell me a little bit about sustainability? Oh, <laughs> this, is, this is one of those topics that you could go on forever. Um, you know, personally speaking, this is one of the reasons why I'm so proud to work at HP. Our focus on sustainability, our focus on the environment, our focus on diversity and, and just helping our communities is one of the things that, that really makes me proud. With regard to sustainability, this is one of the most sustainable products that we have in terms of using recycled materials. For example, ocean-bound plastics. We've taken the ocean-bound plastics and we've actually integrated uh, that plastic into our speaker boxes. The other thing is, is we've taken uh, DVDs and we've recycled those to help make, make the key caps. The system itself is comprised of 35% recycled material. And the other piece of it is, is that from a packaging perspective, all of our packaging, 100% of it is from sustainable sources. So we're taking recycled uh, materials to create our packaging, which then gets recycled again, and it keeps the circle moving. So, you know, those two things alone, I mean, it, it's really cool. It gets, me all, it gets me very excited. That's excellent news. I'm so glad to hear that we're consistent across the full fleet in sustainability. Hey, Rick, thanks so much for your time today. I really appreciate it. I may actually have to run. It seems like my X360 may have just gotten dropped. Thanks. Bye. Okay.